Hello guys, welcome back to Let's Play Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Last time we talked to Alan Natale about the disappearance of his son Shen. And we took out some more Mandalorians. to this campant. We are going to head over to see the sun. Luckily the Arbino Capan has not respawned, it's just this boring campan. You Cassus Sandral is dead. Cassus is dead. And if it has been feared, you should speak to Mirak yourself. You will want to question you on the details of the Sam's death. Mirak left orders he was not to be disturbed, but given the circumstances, I will make an exception. Go into the main hall. Mirak will leave you there. by my protocol droid that you have news about my, my son Cassus. My son Cassus is dead. I have seen his body. Cassus is dead? I was afraid of this. Yet in my heart I knew it must be true. What, what happened to my son? He was killed by Cathounds while exploring the Dancerine ruins. Cathounds? I was so certain the Metali family was to blame. But this changes nothing. My own son is dead. Why should I shed one tear about the disappearance of my bitter enemy's son? I must ask you something, though it is difficult for me. My son had a diary, his private personal thoughts. Now that he is gone, I have nothing else to remember him by. Please, the diary means more to me than it ever could to you. I will give you a hundred credits for its return. Here's a diary, Norik, but you may keep your money. I need no reward for this task. I thank you for this. The diary is all I have left of my son. We have nothing further to discuss. Please, leave me to my grief. <laughs> You are here from the council, are you not? Looking for Shen Metale? Who are you? My name is Rahasia. Nurik is my father. He has not been himself since Cassus disappeared. He is mad with grief, and he is convinced the Metales are responsible. He is not thinking rationally. Does this have anything to do with what happened to Shen? My father is a good man. When my mother died, he raised me and my brother by himself. He loves his children, and we love him. I just don't want you to judge him too harshly. I only want to find Shen Mitali. You must understand that father has been under a terrible strain. I have no wish to disobey him, but there are matters where even my father's authority is not absolute. Please tell me what has happened. My father has kidnapped Shen Mitali. He is holding him prisoner here in the compound. He feels this is a way to get back at the Metales, a way to get even for the disappearance of my brother Cassus. Since Cassus went missing, my father has become unstable. He no longer even cares if the Metales are responsible for what happened to Cassus. 
I am afraid my father will simply kill Shen out of a mad, misguided lust for vengeance. I must tell the Jedi Council at once. The Jedi Council does not have the authority to search our estate, and if father finds out his secret has been revealed, he might kill Shen right away. Please, find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. I would take you to the prison, but I cannot let my father see me with you. Take this key. It will open an unguarded door at the rear of the estate. You and Shen can make your escape through there. There are many security droids guarding the halls. Please hurry. You are Shen's only hope. What's the problem? Why do you care about Shen? Shen and I, we... Well, we have been taught by our families to hate each other, just for being related to our fathers. But I met Shen alone one day in the city, away from his father. And, and Shen was so charming, so sweet. He didn't care at all that I was a Sandral. He just accepted me for, for who I was, with no reservations. We talked and met again over months and fell in love. My brother Cassus met him too, and they were beginning to become friends. But then this whole mess had to happen. Please find Shen and free him. Yeah, I'm so free him. Yeah. Why am I over here? Why am I, why am I all the way over here? I'm very bad. Oh, all your power! That's how bad the game can be sometimes on this Xbox. On, on the Xbox what 360. What can I do? Yes. But when I'm on the um, when it's on the original Xbox, it crashes at some point. So that's why I got this on the 360 because even though it'll lag, I can complete the game. Here to rescue you, Shen. Rescue me? No, I won't leave. It's too dangerous. I'll protect you, Shen. Let's go. It's not my own safety I'm concerned about. I'm worried about the fate of Nurik's daughter, Rahasia. She's been trying to convince her father to release me ever since I was captured. If 
by escape, Nurik will think Rahasia is to blame. Nurik is insane with grief over the loss of his son, Cassus. If I leave with you, it is Rahasia who will suffer. I cannot allow that. How can I get you to come with me? If you can convince Rahasia to escape with us, I will accompany you. Though I do not know if she'd be willing to turn her back on her home and family. Who could imagine a Sandal doing such a thing for the sake of a Metali? But if she will not go, then I too shall stay. I would rather face my own death than have her face her father's wrath because I escaped. I guess we turn Asia. I wish. doing here? Have you found Shen yet? I'm trying to rescue Shen, but it won't leave without you, Rahasia. Shen can be so stubborn sometimes. If one of the security droids sees me wandering the hall, his father will get suspicious. I can't risk it. And I know Shen would rather die than leave me here alone to face the wrath of my father. Tell Shen I will meet you outside the gates. I will wait as long as I can, but you must hurry. Let's go talk to Shane and end the video there. So that'll be able to have the concentration later on. You're back. The video. Have you spoken to Rahasia? Yeah, she promised she would meet us outside the gates. I pray she is not just telling me what I want to hear, but I'll have to take that chance. Hurry then, we must not keep Rahasia waiting. Shen, you're safe. Rahasia, oh, thank goodness you managed to escape. It was all thanks to this kind Jedi that we managed to get this far at all. I thank you, Jedi, for all that you've done for us. We will continue this conversation next time, and we'll leave this on a cliffhanger. Thanks for watching. May the Force be with you always.